hello everyone welcome back to my unreal engine tutorial series so today i'm going to show you how to implement this hiding in bush mechanism in the ai level so so far i have worked on the change in the material and other stuff and today i'm going to show you how to integrate this everything and put together with the in order to work with the AI characters like this so as you can see when I'm outside the bush the enemy character start detecting me and once I go inside the bush he the detection meter please like this and as always this episode is sponsored by these generous patreons Thank you very much for the support you guys are giving me. Okay. So, yeah, let's work on the AI component of making this, this character hidden when he's inside a bush. So, at the moment, my character can see even if I am inside a bush. So, that's why he's seeing me. So we need some way to hide this character and I tried with different approaches like making this visibility ignoring so but it seems uh, they are not working I don't know why I don't know how the internal implementation of this perception system I haven't seen the C++ code so anyway therefore I'll I want to take a much simpler approach so basically what I'm trying to do is I'm gonna place some object around the character so that it will block the visibility of the AI character of this player character right so for that I'm gonna set up a simple blueprint like this actor I'm gonna call it EP hide box and basically this is uh, some couple a couple of cubes well let's add a cube like this and here I'm gonna make it no collisions no I'll make it block all and go to custom and here I'll ignore everything and only the visibility I'll block like this so yeah now let's see if the character can see me if I place this object around the player character like this there is this must be a little bit bigger so I'll make the size two 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 like this okay now let's check right now even if I go in front of this um, enemy character he's not seeing me all right so I'll disable the visibility of this one this is the hide box and then I'll do something like this uh, I need a uh, yeah, I'll add a new method in my BPI character interface so toggle to uh, toggle the hidden state and actually I don't need that because this hidden state is happening here yeah here so here uh, I set the toggle state I have to set this hide box 
collisions enable and disable that's all I have to do it's very simple but it gets the job done so it's not a stupid if it is working set collision Box, how to get child adapter set collisions set actor enable collision here when this is hidden that means when I am inside a bush I need to enable collisions for this one and when I leave the bush I need to disable collisions like this and by default this must not have any collisions so here in the event graph I set uh, set collisions enabled not for the cube what's the method I used here set act enable collision yeah I'll disable collisions at the begin play for this hide box and it should enable only when I enter a bush uh, so to test this behavior I have set up a patrolling path for this enemy like this and let's see if that working. <gasps> they should look at me. Once I go inside the bush, you can see the detection meter is reducing. <gasps> see? <gasps> okay, this is working there. And yeah, that's all I want to do for today. <gasps> yeah, so my character can hide inside a bush and if you guys think uh, that my work is useful to you and uh, you can consider support uh, my work in patreon and uh, also I have uploaded a source code update uh, yesterday uh, not yesterday the day before yesterday and I'll soon uh, post an update with this uh, detection system as well detection system and hide in bush mechanism as well and thanks for watching see you in the next episode goodbye and let me know what you guys are think let me know if you have any problems in the comment section